Hey, how's it going there? How's it going out there in YouTube world? It's good to see you all again. I haven't seen you in a few days. Been kind of working, doing some things. For those of you who are new to my channel, you know that I make business um, uh, surrounded around candle making. Uh, so for you candle makers for, for fun, candle makers for hobby, candle makers for business. Of course, I, I have a business, Serene Curations. Uh, you can follow us on Instagram at Serene underscore Curations underscore co. That's Serene underscore Curations underscore co underscore co. Of course, uh, you can follow us on uh, Facebook, uh, Serene Curations. Um, and um, of course, I have a candle making business. And I do videos uh, surrounding around candle making and business um, and things like that. Uh, the last time I, my space was kind of taken up, I wanted to do, I actually did a candle making tutorial um, and I had to kind of do it in a different space because my space was, uh, was, um, this was occupied at the moment. Um, so, uh, but I do want to, uh, I wanted to just uh, interact with you all, bring you all another video, uh, just kind of see how things have been going and kind of let you know how things have been going with me. Also, um, today's video, uh, we're going to talk about uh, a few different things. The first thing we're going to talk about is social media marketing, but more so Instagram marketing. The second thing that we're going to talk about is um, is, is 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 continuing uh, continuing on, uh, continuing and, and not 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 giving up, uh, no matter what the situation is. So. Uh, you can kind of say uh, this is this is, this will be a social media marketing sales no sales kind of video, uh, okay? And um, and then the third thing that we're going to talk about is being comfortable with your level, but not getting complacent. Being comfortable with your level, but not getting complacent. Okay, um, you you have to be comfortable with where you are. But you cannot get complacent. And that may sound a little um, unorthodox, if you will. Social media marketing. All right. When it comes to Instagram, candle business, whatever business, doesn't, it doesn't matter what business you have. When it comes to Instagram, when it comes to social media, when it comes to marketing in general, you have to be consistent. Consistency is key. And a lot of people wonder and want to know. What is it? How is it that I can market and what is it about marketing that is going to um, that, that is going to to, to get and ha allow my business to grow? Because if you are a business and you have no following, you have no followers, no one uh, you have just started or you have not been active. No one knows you. No one knows that you are there. So in order for you to. Uh, grow your business in order for your business to begin to pick up leverage or to pick up business and and to be to get the, to, to to gain the leverage of marketing or to see the 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 fruits of, of of leveraging marketing you have to market you have to let people know that you are there let people know that you are a business you are a company but secondly you have to let them know that you have a good product because people don't know we live in the world of 2022 where um, products, uh, there's all kind of schemes and scams and things like that going on. So you have to let people know that, that, that this is not a scam, that I am not a scam, that I am who I say I am, and my business is who is, is what is, is what and is who, who I say it is. I have the product that I say that I have. And in order for you to let people know that, you have to market. You have to put yourself out there. And you have to be consistent. I'm talking about daily. Even if you're extremely busy and you can only post one one time today, you need to make sure that you make that post. Because um, what will happen is, is that over time, those posts will grow. And you'll look back um, on these years of starting your business when your business is flourishing and is doing really well. And you'll, 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 you'll be grateful that you did post daily. But you leveraging social media means consistency, because uh, from the customer standpoint, the individual that is not consistent in marketing is the individual that's not consistent in business. If you if you're not consistent in marketing, how can they can trust that you're going to be consistent in business, consistent enough to send them their product? Case in point, wholesale. 
you have to be consistent enough to, to, to month to month send wholesale orders. If a store or a brand cannot trust your marketing enough to be consistent and see consistent marketing, how can they trust that you're going to be consistent enough with uh, getting their orders out on a month to month basis? So your marketing has to be consistent. Secondly, not only does your market marketing has to be constant and it has to be consistent, uh, um, y y your marketing has to be secure. Okay. We live in the world of 2022, all right, where there is, you have so many different apps. You have, we have technology at our fingertips, okay? If you look back in the, back in the older days of, of, of when Walmart first started, um, when Mr. Walmart started Walmart, or even further back when Madam C.J. Walker started her hair brand, or if you look back when, when the Colonel started KFC, they did not have the, 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 the leverage of social media, or they did not have the leverage of television. And, and, and they were able to build a million dollar brands in today's money. As a matter of fact, I want you to watch a show on TV. It's called The Men That Built America. The Men That Built America. It's about um, J.P. Morgan, uh, Chase Bank. Uh, it's about a uh, Ford uh, car dealership. It's about um, the Rockefellers, if you know who I'm talking about, those of you who know who I'm talking about. And you will see, and it's such an inspirational show. Um, there's a few episodes and seasons to it because what you have to understand is in those days, there were no social media. There were no telephones. There were no televisions. There were no radios. And these individuals were able to build brands so big that they are still around today, hundreds of years later. And that's the kind of thing that you want to do. You want your business to not just be a business, but to be a legacy, okay? To be something that, that's still servicing people 20 years from now. To your business to be able to allow you to invest in other businesses that's going to help other individuals, Okay, and marketing, you have the world at your fingertips, apps, you have Canva, you have for labels, you have Avery, um, you have a Shopify for a website, you have all of these different types of things at your fingertips. I urge you to market, 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 utilize, 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 research, research, research. And of course, again, we live in 2022. There's going to be some people out there that's going to be giving you some fluff. Eat the meat and spit out the bone. If you know they're giving you fluff, take what's good. The rest of it, you leave it there. But there's just we live in a world today where your business can flourish. Now, of course, businesses are saturated because the more that we, the more technology we have, and the more things begin to open up, the more individuals begin to 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 get involved or to 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 to, to open businesses and things like that. Well, you and your candle business per se has the I have the opportunity to grow above and around that. Utilizing marketing, utilizing social media marketing, utilizing uh, just the internet, period, in marketing, radio, television, all of these things. But you have to find your niche, find your way, and make your way, and pave a way for your business and for your company. You have to pave a way. Um, because, I mean, that no one else is going to do it for your business but you. <laughs> So, you know, of course, you have to pave the way. Um, and, 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 and that's just kind of where we are right now. <clears throat> and candle making, I, I'm going to be honest with you. It is awesome. It's, a, it's fun. It, 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 it's, you, you're constantly learning. You're constantly doing things. Okay. And it's awesome for the entrepreneur because you can make candles, you can have fun, and you can earn revenue. And you can build a business around it. There's just so many different um, directions that you can go with it. Wholesale, retail, uh, direct to, uh, online, direct to consumer, retail, store, direct to consumer. So many different ways that you can go. And you can, you can actually, you can go all of them if you want to. But you have to stay consistent and you have to keep going. Uh, there's going to be some times where you're not going to feel like it, but you have to do so. Um, and, and, and which leads me into... Uh, you know, my next uh, topic 
is is that, that I wanted to talk to you all about is, um, is 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 continuing on. No matter what the no matter what it looks like, you're gonna get some no's. You're gonna get some do doors closing your face. There's gonna be some times where you're gonna wonder why your business is not growing, why your following is not growing. But you cannot allow that to stop you. You cannot allow one negative to stop a hundred positive that positives that could happen down the road. Keep going. No matter what your sales look like, no matter what the, the, the no matter what's going on, you have to keep going. The, if you don't keep going, then I, I'm sorry to say this, and I hope this doesn't offend anyone, but you're not an entrepreneur. Because you, entrepreneurs understand one thing: there's going to be no, there's going to be negative, there's going to be nonsense. But we also understand that it is the drive and the motivation and the inspiration and 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 and, and, and the resilience and all, all of those things that is gonna, that that is what's going to allow a business to flourish. Mr. Walmart started selling products out of the trunk of his car. Okay, and look at Walmart today. Jeff Bezos had a handwritten Amazon sign before uh, Amazon was all over the place. The colonel was 60 years old when he started KFC. So your situation is no different. You just have to get out there and go for it and, 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 and get to it. So if you're sitting at home and you're saying to yourself, can I do this? Should I do this? Am I able to do this? Yes. Yes, you can. Yes, you should. Execution. 99% of businesses that don't get off the ground because it, it when, excuse me, let, 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 let me not lie. I, I don't want to, you know, um, uh, most of the businesses that don't even get going is because of an individual did not execute. And the other half is our businesses that the individual did, but they did not continue on. Even if you switch directions and you go into a total different market, you might have a service business and, 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 and you might be led in another direction to open up a product business. And that's the, the, the beauty of entrepreneurship is that you're not subject to just one business, one industry. You can go wherever your business takes you. If you want to have a candle business and, and a, 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 um, a lawn care business, go right ahead. It's up to you to make those things happen. So you have to keep going. Don't allow customers, don't allow sales, don't allow family members, friends, or anyone to stop you from getting up, getting out there, and getting it going. Because the entrepreneurship is there. The product is there. The customers are there. There's always going to be 90, 90, uh, 90 consumers to, uh, 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 to 10 producers. What do I mean? The consumer market is always going to be there and it's always going to outweigh uh, the production market. There's never going to be enough production to outdo consumers because there's so many different industries. Uh, people are buying daily. They're, they're purchasing daily in a lot of different industries. I, my industry and our industry in this uh, circle just has to be candles. And this is what we do. We make candles. And people are purchasing candles, but you have to make, you have to have a good product. You have to have a working product and you have to put yourself out there. It is the only way that your business is going to make it. It is the only way that people are going to know you're there is if you put yourself out there. I'm here. When you take the lid off this candle, it smells wonderful. Who's going to know that besides you if you don't let anyone know? So you have to put yourself out there. Set goals for your business and begin to reach and, 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 and overcome those goals. And I promise you, I promise you, things will begin to work out. I cannot say when, but I can assure you that if you do these things, they will work out for you. I promise you, 
I mean, it, it's just it, 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 it's, it's something that 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 I mean, it goes it goes without saying within within anything in life, but especially entrepreneurship. Execution is key. If you don't execute, hmm, no one knows you're there. And your business will never go anywhere. Watch the founder. Watch, it's about Ray Kroc and McDonald's. Watch that movie. It's a very, very, very inspirational movie. One of my favorite movies. It's called The Founder. I love that movie. So, entrepreneurship. So, and, 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 okay, my, my YouTube family, my candle-making family, um, let's, let us rise to the occasion. Let us rise to the occasion and show the world that the luxury and the minimalist candle market can do it. We can do numbers and we can make it. Doesn't matter who you are. And we're making it. It's happening. Okay? If you just happen to be one of those individuals who's just starting and you see, um, you know, there are top flight individuals whose labels are here, whose store is here, who's done this, who's been there. Don't allow that to deter you because one thing you must realize is that those people at one point started from somewhere. They may have even started out worse than you started out. So don't let that deter you. As a matter of fact, let it be your inspiration. Let it be your guide. Let it be your motivation. And I promise you, if you do those things, Everything will work out. It's always a pleasure to speak with you all. Um, and I will see you all soon. And I want you to remember one thing. Remember two things, as I always say. Stay positive. Stay safe. And, um, yeah, let's rise to the occasion. My people in the east, yo, you gotta wake up Midwest, dirty south, yo, you gotta stand up All my homies in the west, yo, you gotta wake up Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up.